you win. <laughs> What did I just do? Hello everyone and welcome to another video. This time we're gonna check out Anna's changes in Season 3. Uh, she's got some quality of life changes with better hitboxes and a couple of new sweet, sweet buffs like uh, a better combo after back to two and um, a new wall running mode which, which is used in combos. So let's get into it. Um, the first thing I want to talk about is the rage drive. They increased the pushback slightly on block which means that her full crouch uh, down for two with less, less often for no reason. Because in season two, after the rage drive, the full crouch hole would never hit pretty much. They also increased the tracking on full crouch down for two slightly to one side. I don't think the increase in tracking is that huge, but I mean, it certainly helps at least a bit. Now let me turn off Rage, because we won't need it anymore. The next change is in her forward 4. Oh, let me make the dummy stand. Forward 4 is now a new wall bounce. On its own, it's not a really good move. It's minus 13 on block and 19 frames fast. So it's pretty, pretty slow even for a whiff punisher. Uh, you can get some nice damage with this at the wall with uh, stuff like 2-4 two, two, into your standard wall combo. But the main difference uh, this move is going to make is that after counter hits down for long plus 2, you can connect forward 4 for a wall bounce, which is going to deal a lot of damage. The next change is in her down forward one. They reduced the pushback between her and the opponent slight, slightly uh, on hit. And now back to two. This is one of her best changes in my opinion. You can now get a really consistent mini combo with down back three plus four. Uh, yeah, down back three plus four, three for 53 points of damage. Or you can get uh, another mini combo for slightly more damage, but it is more difficult to connect. And it's the slight, slightest, it's the slightest dash forward into down three four one. Takes some practice, but it's it's not that difficult to connect in my opinion. Um, and the next change is on her hot kick. From Chaos Judgment, they changed the frames. It's now one frame uh, safer. It's minus 13 instead of 14, so she will not get launch punished for this anymore. Forward 4 3. They changed the recovery by one frame on hit. It's faster. I'm guessing that this um, has an impact on the float combos from Forward 4 3. The, the combo would go as hmm, forward 4-3 four, into down 4-1 on uh, when she catches the opponent midair. Hmm. Sometimes this, this combo would whip, I mean the down 4 would sometimes whip. So I'm guessing it's gonna be way more consistent yeah. now. And quarter circle forward 4. This move used to knock down in wall splat. It's still boss plots, uh, just not from that far. So now she can keep up her pressure on hit against the opponent. And this is really nice because Quarter Suku Forward 4 is a mid that has great tracking. So it should be used pretty often unless the opponent can punish it. 
and it also goes into full crouch so on hit and I pretty much gets a free full crouch mix up because the opponent is too much minus to do anything other than blocking okay the next change oh uh, it's now also a tailspin move it was not a tailspin move previously uh, like it tailspins mid, com mid combo I don't think it's gonna be really useful in combos though. The next change. While running 2-3, it's natural on normal hit. First hit is minus 13, second hit is minus 12, but I think it has some pushback, so some opponents might have difficulty with jab punishing this move. Uh, anyway, this is not a really useful move in the neutral, it's great for combos. In season 2, after some combos, her wall carry enders like forward super forward 2 1 and down forward 3 1 4, um, the last hits would whip. For example, in this combo. And as you can see, it's quite easy to connect the ender. It's much better for wall carry. And they also increase the damage on her wall stunning. One slightly by one damage, so now it deals the same amount of damage as her down for run. And that would be it for the changes for Anna. I really love the new running move, uh, you know, while running two, three, and I love the new combo opportunities from back to two. She's a better character now, and yeah, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye bye!